Okay, class, let's begin. Okay, if I give you something like this, intersection between two lines, how do you do? How do you do them? If I say there's one line y equals to x plus 2 and another line of uh, y equals to uh, let's say negative x. How do you find the point of intersection? We make simultaneous, right? That's all we do. Substitution. Both of them will give you the same answer. Okay, let's say we, we do it by... Wait, which one should you do first? Sub simultaneous or substitution? Simultaneous. If you can do simultaneous, if you can only you do substitution, this is the priority. At this level, at this simple question, so you can't feel it too much, but when you go to the higher level, then simultaneous is your priority. So this is equation one, this is equation two. So how do we do simultaneous? One minus two, y minus y. 0, x minus minus x, 2x plus 2. So we got ourselves a simple minus 1. Okay, once we got here, are we done? We one point of intersection. So you start back into equation 1 or equation 2. In this case, 2 is a lot easier. So we got y equals to 1. So the intersection point is negative 1 and 1. This is how we do the concepts for intersection between, between two lines. All right? I understand the concept. That's what I want you to do today. Not the calculation too much. So now, if I ask you this question... between lines, intersection between lines and circle. You are given, let's say, the line is y equals to 2x plus 3 and the circle is x squared minus 2x plus y squared minus 4y equals to 0. How do we solve this one? Same technique. What is the same technique? Simultaneous or substitution. But for this case, however, we cannot do simultaneous. There's, so we do our substitution. You want to substitute what inside what? Substitute this y inside here. Okay, today's, if you just, today's lesson, if you're just trying to go through the numbers, you will be lost. Try to understand the concepts. So we start inside here. And I try my best not to write down too many things. And you should be able to get yourself some things like this. Maybe I should do this one. Square. And what and you try to solve them up and you get yourself something like this in the end.
How do you solve from here? Calculator, quadratic equation. And you get yourself x equals to 3 over 5 and negative 1. How do you solve from here? You sub. Which equation is easier for you to sub? Obviously, the line. Are we done? Why not? We want a point. In this case, points. That will be your answers. Okay? So what concept have we learned? If it's intersection between lines or circle, the concepts are the same? It's a simultaneous or substitution? Understand the concepts. The calculation will be too crazy today. Okay, I show you to you one more time. Can we move on? Yes, please. So now, intersections I think this is supposed to be S there of two circles. Let's say you're given x squared plus y squared minus 10x minus 10y plus 25 equals to 0. Yeah, the numbers are not that important. The important is concept for today. So how do we solve this one? <laughs> We're intermission. Technician is here. Okay, how do you solve this one? Technician was asking whether there is this place, okay. What concept? Or? Okay, simultaneous or substitution. How should, which one should we choose? I hear simultaneous just now because simultaneous is our priority. But how the heck are you going to simultaneous this one? Let's say this is simul equation 1, equation 2. So we do 1 minus 2 or 2 minus 1 are the same things. So x squared minus x squared, 0. y squared minus y squared, 0. Understand that? So now things got a lot simpler. So we got ourselves minus 13x. Minus 10y minus 10 I said minus sorry minus 10x minus 3x minus minus 3x is 7x minus 10y minus minus 3y plus 11y 25 minus 4 Hey, shoot, 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 shoot <laughs> Sorry, sorry My mouth is not coherent with what I said 25 minus 4 21 Goes to zero. Let me rewrite that again. Which one negative? Am I right now? Sorry, too many things going on in my head. 
And from here, you can simplify them up. It's not that difficult. Simplify. And rearrange. Okay, we got ourselves now equation of line. We are not yet, we don't get the point. So how do we solve it? Sub into what? Okay, just like just now when we got a line and a circle, we do a substitution. So now this equation here, which is now equation of line, sorry about that, you need to substitute inside either of these two. Any one of them will be fine. And then you repeat the same process again as how we do for intersection line and circle just now. Okay? So it's the same process again. So you sub into... And then as you did just now, you will get the same answer. Uh, you, you will get the answers. Okay, I'm going to be very quick on that one. If you do this process, you get yourself Of course, you need to show the working as well. I think I write down over here. Just for being formal. But what I want you to get today is the idea. And once you got here, you will get yourself this quadratic equation. And then you get yourself this. Are we done over here? No. We want a point. We want points. The ideas are the same. If you want intersection, it's always simultaneous and substitution. Alright? The concepts are the same. Get that. You guys okay? Can we move on? Five, four. I can see someone staring at me. <laughs> glaring, glaring. Okay, the next part is the newest part that you haven't learned in school. 